I don't know if this is Yuju's solo debut. I don't know if she did any solo stuff while she was in GFriend, but she's here with her new song, Play, as Yuju, solo artist, solo idol person. And let's check it out. I'll watch it twice. I haven't seen any teasers or anything, so I'm, I'm excited for this. I'm gonna watch it twice, first without subtitles and then with. Are you gonna be pole dancing in this one? Cause girl, you tease me in that mago. You go. You do go. Oh. Voice. Love that piano. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Is that a piano? I don't know. So much red. Ew, that's creepy. Is she the doll? Ooh, what a relaxed kind of sultry sexy vibe. Ooh. Oh my god. <gasps> I love that. I can't do it. Curtains close. What a beautiful set. What's the cake for? Oh, look at these colors. This feels like she's locked, she's trapped, and then that is her breaking free. Also kind of seeing the similar things with like the doll being controlled by a puppeteer. Puppet master? Is puppeteer and puppet master the same, same thing? <gasps> is this her breaking free? What does the color red symbolize? Is it blood? Play. Oh, beautiful. I felt like a weird. Is that a mistake? That feels weird. Like why? Okay, anyway. Oh, oh she did that so beautifully, like a flower like blooming. Oh, that is also kind of like just blooming, like being free and like getting to spread your wings, kind of symbolizing. Oh, that silhouette. Red flower. Oh my god, her vocals! Oh, that reminds me like a little of the high note kind of thing. Is it she who does that in Apple? Like the kind of haunting siren kind of singing. It's a very beautiful kind of atmosphere. And she can like... She has no problem creating that with that voice. The mysterious like sexy sophisticated, sultry. It's really giving. I wonder what that means. Does that mean play? I want to watch it right away with subtitles. That's not a piano, bitch. I said that was a piano. That's like a guitar string kind of instrument. String? Listen, I'm Swedish and dumb, so don't come for me.
I don't know anything about music. That's really beautiful. Burn my broken heart. It's time for a rebirth, bitch. That's what fire does. Why have you been waiting? Have you been controlled? I love the shoes. Oh yeah, look, this is supposed to be her kind of. I love the shoes. Yeah, oh, she thinks about when flowers bloom. Oh, that's so beautiful. She even does that. Um, that's what I thought it was supposed to symbolize as well. Oh, that's why everything's red. Oh, is that what you departed? Oh, that is so beautiful. Departed. So maybe I was just reading too much into it. Maybe it's just like a love song. Unless. Read. Oh, her voice. Oh, that's so beautiful how that switches for the bridge that you know that or that that or that anyway <laughs> same Oh, that's beautiful, what she said. Oh, it's so haunting. It's so beautiful. Her voice there. I feel like there's something like about this that really just portrays and really shows. You can really tell how long she's been like in the industry, how experienced she is, how good she is, how refined this is kind of. It's very... It's very impressive and like how she controls everything, all the movements, how she like pulls it in when she's supposed to and then lets it out a bit more for, to enhance uh, particular parts of the song, like vocally and choreography wise. It just feels like she's very good at doing that. And I feel like it also adds to like the whole this the song is called like play, right? The puppeteer kind of play, the love, the game of love. And like the pulling back when you're supposed to and giving more and like what you say and what you what you choose to say and what you choose to don't say. What you choose to do and you choose, what you choose not to do. <laughs> Mercury retrograde. I'm trying. At least. 
that's kind of what I'm reading into it. The lyrics were beautiful as well. There was something like really disturbingly pleasant and pleasantly disturbing about this is how I would like describe this song. And I think this kind of concept really fits her. I don't know her that well, but I loved her on the pole in Mago. And you know, she can really fucking belt it out. She's got a, a amazing fucking voice. And this really portrays that in kind of like a different way, in a more like humble way, in a more, in a different way, I would say. Very, 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 very. Just say something else than very. No, I can't. I wanted to say it was very like, yeah, kind of like, you know, experienced. Seasoned, I want to say. Very seasoned, you can tell. Yeah, that's just a different word for it. But yeah. So, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if this is going to have like a live stage or anything. But if it does, I'm good. If it will. If it does. If it will. I will react to it on my Patreon. And where I have other G-Friend related things. I, I'm... The tags are D is G friend, but I'm just gonna add this to that anyway. So we have like all the girls, and then when VVs make their debut and everything, so you can check the pinned comment for that. And anything you want to tell me, let me know in the comments. And thank you so much for watching this. Please like this video if you did, and subscribe if you want to. But only if you want to. Thank you for watching. Bye. God, I'm so cringe.